Hey guys, welcome name, to the Retro Gaming Junction. This is Camellio, and we are live on Twitch every day at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. We're continuing our game of TIE Fighter. Again, you are going back to save the TIE Advanced Plant CA-13 and our supply convoy bound for it. Okay. Did we do that once? I don't think so. We expect rebel forces to attack our Imperial resupply convoy just before it reaches the plant. Rebels. <gasps> Juicy rebels. So rare. With only a few TIE advanced plants left in existence, this mission is one of great importance. Hey, Super Dan! I love this game. Why loved? Do people say, oh, I loved Super Mario Bros. 3? Oh, I Again, love Zelda? To save the they say, oh, I love TIE Zelda. I love TIE Fighter. <laughs> We expect with only a few tie advanced plants left in existence. Do you still love it? Is one of Do you hate it now? <laughs> Do you still not love it? If you even if you haven't played in 20 years, I'm sure you still love the game. And Imperial Convoy Rope 17 that is en route with important plant equipment. A space. Since its recapture from Zarin, the ZA13 facility has been undergoing reconstruction and upgrade. Previously, it had been responsible for hyperdrive engine production only, but since the loss of the Omar manufacturing facilities, its assembly lines are being expanded to allow for complete TIE advanced production. The supply convoy that is delivering the final equipment for these assembly lines has come under rebel attack. No doubt the rebels are trying to take advantage of the recent confusion going on inside the Empire. Above all else, <laughs> you must ensure that the factory itself Confusion, that's that's a forces. way to put it. Confusion, that's... Rebel spacecraft have already made one attack on the Rope 17 convoy while en route to ZA-13. Y-wings are now reported in the area, so more Rebel craft are expected once the Y-wings radio back their findings to Rebel command. Hopefully, the Rebels have not coordinated their attack with Zarin's forces. Defending against such a combined attack would be extremely perilous. You will be the flight leader, TIE Defender Alpha-1. Awesome. You will have two wingmen. Your craft will be armed with 16 advanced missiles. Can't they? Huh. I beg to differ, my friend. They do for me. <laughs> they never recreate... I mean, I can never recreate the same feeling I have... Pl I play a game, like, for the first time. But even for modern game, that's for any games. But I can definitely appreciate more games that are from a certain period. <clears throat> My point exactly. Of course, the first time is always the first time for modern or for for retro. But like I said, like I was saying, like for modern games, I replay them and I'm like. Uh, they don't age as well, in my eye. They seem simple and boring. <laughs> uh, let's go with that. There's no secondary objective, so let's launch. Defense missile, yeah. I'm never trying to like recreate what it was back then. You, you just can't do that. This channel is more about seeing game, finding games that are still definitely enjoyable today and definitely playable. Scratch those rebels. Uh, what are goals? Must have survived until other goals completed. Carve. That is true for the most part, but it's not only the game's fault. Also because we're older now. Young people today experience modern games the way we experience our visual heroes. I'm not so sure. I'm not so sure about that. Some games are good, but it's just not the same. There's a complexity that we kind of peaked in the 2000s and then petered down and then games are not... Nowadays, games are fallen a little bit like the movies. It's all retreading the same routes and 
and we're kind of a little like loop i think vr will make it something different and might spark something different because back in the day if you remember i'm sure you're old enough like every year there was something new not necessarily definitely graphically but also gameplay wise like new concepts new i know it was really different like every year it was like ah that game did that that wow wow nowadays it's just like oh that new game just did, did what the, the other game did just a little bit better <laughs> so I, I know i know i'm right <laughs> Like everybody who, who checks retro and plays retro games knows that because they have fallen in love with that that old feeling that and some I think the younger generation think that it's the simplicity of it for me it's not that because I mostly play PC game but Super Nintendo and other platform also but mostly PC game because I like the complexity and the concepts that were different back in the days and even uh, gameplays that don't even exist like this this doesn't even exist <clears throat> nowadays they don't make the games like this the most close to this I found is like Elite Dangerous I bought it I tried it <sighs> it's not this it's just like free space running around ho 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 That was quick. You finish already? Oh, that was really quick. Cause last time I saw you was like eight something, eight, almost just before I started. And the counter was like zero on my stream, and you were still running your game and wasn't finished. Done. So, as I was saying, retro games are the best. <laughs> Some games nowadays, what, what games can I say that like recently wowed me? There were a couple. Uh, well, there were. Boarding operation complete. And it's just recently that I realized that it was a retro game. <laughs> about like five years ago maybe maybe a little more I'm like I guess I I just play or almost exclusively play retro games well retro games like games between I'd say 86 87 and maybe even earlier maybe 84 to uh, 2000 I still play recent game, but like 2005, it goes down. Like the number of I want to make a <laughs> a chart of that for some reason. I want to list out all my favorite games. There's about a hundred of them, maybe a little more, and put them by year and <laughs> make a graphic or some shit and know just to see. I'm really curious to see like my favorites game are from what year. I think it's like 90. A, it, it must be between 98 and 2000, something like that. There's a year that, in there that, that there's about like 20 games, maybe more, that I'm really in love with. Yeah, there's a, yeah, okay, yeah, there's a couple of new games that like couldn't have existed and didn't exist in the retro where I feel like the, the big open world games and stuff like that. That's really awesome that we have games like that. But I, I think we haven't really... So, what do I have to do? Come on. The factory... The factory is okay. I don't think it's gonna die. The cargo ferry, maybe. Motor conveyor... Vendor must finish docking. Okay, maybe if I check the map... I'm, I'm just talking. I will check the chat. Hey, Sin! The original Sin games. <laughs> yeah, the original Sin games. Yes. Games. Game, you mean? I played the freaking episode 1. I paid and played and thought that it might become something. <sighs> yeah. 
and I didn't like pay it like uh, um, uh, discounted. No, no, no. When it came out, I I think I even like pre. <laughs> I was like, sin, boom, here's my cash. Uh, it was okay, I guess. It would have been nice to continue it. Some open world, so we go, oh, 98 was quite a year. Oh, yes, 98. 98 is the year of the first person shooter. Like Unreal, um, Unreal Half Life. <sighs> there's others. Shogo. Um, there's a bunch. There's a few modern games that... The only game that I'm excited about that's coming is... Uh, the Cyberpunk game. And even that, I, I'm not sure anymore. There's the remake of System Shock, I guess. Yeah, the Sin episode shooter. Yeah, it was supposed to be the Sin... If you were talking about that, the which might be 98 also. The Sin first person shooter. That's kind of like there's branching missions. Like if you finish, uh, uh, if you finish not a mission but a level, a certain way it'll branch out to another level. It's kind of weird. We're talking about original Sin. Yes, original Sin. Original Sin. I didn't play the original Sin two. Being shot at the the Terry by Yellow Three. That's all I can see. Okay. Yellow Three. Yeah, exactly. Okay, let's attack that guy. Yeah, Cyberpunk, and I should play Original Sin Two. Uh, I should play that. I've played not much hours of uh, what's going on with my joystick. Of Planescape, um, Tides of Numenera, and it wasn't that great. I don't know. It, I can't say it's not great. I just I really didn't like it. It's not my style, or I don't know. I don't know. It wasn't torment. <laughs> That's for sure. Oh. There you go. That's the way to do it. Oh, it's going so slow. Good hunting Alpha One. Yeah, I knew you would say that. But what People don't really like Alpha that game, one. I think, Mission right? I think the consensus is it's not that great, and the Pillars was is a better game. Uh, Alpha one, begin boarding operation. Okay. Ah, there you go. This seems like an easy mission. Boarding operation complete. Do I have to kill that? Do not allow the Corvettes near us, Alpha One. Get them now. Oh really? I have to destroy the Corvettes? Okay. Uh, okay, I can do that. Uh. Request for reinforcements acknowledged. Ah, missiles! Shit. I don't know if that will be enough. Sir, using your target for attack. 
18 shields. Oh, zero shields. Oh, 12 all. Wow. Oh, he's down. Oh, they didn't do shit on this one. Uh oh. Alpha one, incoming missile. Oh, eighty-eight percent. Okay, they're doing something. I lost interest after Ice One Delta Two. Yeah, same. I didn't. I played System uh, Icewind L2, but that's it. Alpha one, incoming missile. <laughs> this seems like an easy mission. It's usually magic words that make an enemy forget show up. Yeah, yeah I guess. I I'm sure it's not an easy mission. There's no easy mission anymore. Oh, this still works. Oh, 50%. 15. Target destroyed. destroyed. Kill that one here. Transmission received. Alpha 1. Using your target for attack. Resupply transport awaiting orders to reload you, Alpha 1. Reload? Yes. I should have taken, like, torpedoes. Do I reload? Well, it goes down pretty fast. <laughs> you know what? We'll even do this. I think it go even faster. They're gonna kill it. Uh, next, Cobra Four. Cobra Four. I need to reload. Alpha One. Boarding operation complete. I usually do a bit of trouble. Come on. Yeah, this should be okay. This old guy would give me more missiles. Commence reload operation. We're good. Ah. Uh, is this an enemy? Reload operation complete. Um, Cobra four. Attack it. Alpha one, using your target for attack. Come 
Transporting operation. Boarding operation complete. It's dead. Okay, for the big ship, that's it. Doo -doo, doo -doo. Wing Commander 3. Oh, Wing Commander 3 is a good game. I will play the Wing Commander 3, Wing Commander series. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm going to play the one in the, the first and second one. I have good and bad memories about them. They were good games, but I remember being very tough. Especially the... The expansion. Like the secret mission thing, I think it was called. Whatever, it was super tough. The third one is a great game, well balanced and all. I don't think the missions are better than this, but I do appreciate the, the storyline though. And the FMVs, <laughs> of course. And Mark Hamill. So, all in all, I think I'll be enjoying maybe more than this. But we'll see. I wanted to replay this because I haven't played TIE Fighter in years. And I've played many other shooters. Like, I have really great memories of Free Space. If you're looking for a great shooter and you think you've, you've beaten them all and you've played all the good ones, the Wing Commanders, the X Wings, play Free Space. It's incredible. When I was, I remember when I was playing Free Space, I was like, this is better than TIE Fighter. Like, all in all, I might prefer this, but there are things in Free Space that are not in TIE Fighter. It's a more recent game, it has uh, other mechanics, uh, it's, it's a great game. The missions are pretty fantastic. Favorite Space Combat Trader game? Exactly! A trader game. No, I'm not talking about free. Oh, we're not talking about the same game, I think. If you're talking about the kind of open world trade game, it's not that. I'm talking Boarding about. It's something free, free space, something. There's a side. There's a subtitle. Decent free space. It's decent free space. He's talking about freelancer, exactly. Yeah, he's talking about freelancer. Freelancer is okay. It's the most recent. Uh, it's playable with a mouse, which I appreciate. This is not really playable with a mouse. <clears throat> Some people have said that they've played this game with a mouse. I do believe them, but wow. I'm doubtful that they finished a the game with a mouse. I guess when you get this this little fighter here, whoa, I'm way too fast for you little A-Wing. The fastest ship in the, in the Rebel fleet. You are dead, my friend. Hey, you're nothing compared to uh, a tie advance. Oh my god, that was funny. We're still fine, right? This is a long mission. If something goes wrong here, I'll be pissed. I should check the map just in case. Whoa, where are they? Okay. Here. Nothing's going on. Okay, we're, we're good. We're good. They, they throw you one or two uh, easy mission once in a while. Once in a blue moon. What I like about the... Eh, my shields, wow. Oh, shields are more important right now. 
about the Wing Commander games is in missions you jump from point to point. That's really nice. I appreciate that. Feels a little bit more complex, a bit more real. These missions are all like you go here, even if you have hyperspace capabilities, you'll never follow a guy in hyperspace, like the guy flies off and you have to track him or some, something like that. Woohoo! Freelance to co op, nice, yeah. Decent free space is incredible. Not decent, not the, the the classic decent, which is a decent game. <laughs> it's a quite good game, I want to play it on the channel eventually. So that's it, and since TIE Fighter is an incredible game, you can do times 2 speed or times 4 speed. Commence boarding operation, boarding operation complete. Superb work, Alpha 1, primary objectives completed. The resupply was successful. You were able to stop the rebels' futile attempt. Hyperspace, I think. Yes, even bonus, but not all the bonus, it seems. What did we accomplish? The TIE Advanced plant has been resupplied, and many rebel craft have been destroyed. As of now, the plant is guarded by a pair of Nebulon B frigates. Soon, the plant will be in full production of TIE Advanced Starfighters. No! During the recent engagement, the rebels were using Mag Pulse warheads. This new warhead technology temporarily disables laser cannon weapon systems by draining their stored energy. This latest advance in weaponry is not completely understood, but appears to be very useful. Imperial Were they talking about R? Yes, it was R. Okay. At first I thought... Has been resupplied and many rebel craft okay. have been I thought it was talking about their... Their... Uh, their TIE Advanced craft. Because they have TIE Advanced. I don't want to fight TIE Advanced. Our scouts have followed the attacking rebels to their base platform. We have orders to capture it. Alpha group will hyper in first. The platform must be disabled. Watch out for rebel starfighters. Once Alpha group disables the platform, troops will land to secure the structure. Okay, so we have to disable the platform. A platform. We will arrive to retrieve you and some Magpulse warheads after the platform has been secured. Magpulse warheads. Do we get that eventually? Our scouts have you will be wingman, TIE Defender. Our intelligence Tide network Defend. has uncovered Always. the rebel wow. source for the Mag Pulse weapon, which was used against the Rope 17 convoy. Our forces are to launch an assault on the installation where production of this weapon occurs. We hope to obtain working copies of the Mag Pulse weapon from the platform. Gaining this technology will help in our arms race with Zarin. The rebels are expected to mount a strong defense of their installation. Currently, only a small number of rebel starfighters are stationed there, but we anticipate reinforcements will be sent. There are also rumors that the rebels have a new experimental starfighter, but information is extremely limited. Expect the unexpected. Ooh. Disable any craft fleeing from the platform so our forces can capture the occupants. We wish to capture prisoners to interrogate. Preferably officers and technicians who worked on the Magpulse weapons development. I get you. Heavy rockets? Oh, yeah. How many? I just want to pierce the shield. Remember, your primary task is to disable the platform. Yes, yes, yes. Blue must be captured. I'm gonna shoot Incoming two and see what that does. We need to capture the platform. Quickly disable it. 
Did they shot it in midair? Shit. Imperial transport here to reload you when ready, Alpha One. No. We're good, I think. Come on, guys, attack the platform. Alpha Two, this is Flight Group Alpha using your target for attack. Ah, fuck it. There you go. Target disabled. Good work in Blue. disabling the platform, Alpha One. It is captured, okay. Corvette's rampart to RS 32. We are here to help. Alpha Two, incoming missile. Alpha Two, mission critical craft under attack. Which one? A short transport group leopard to Alpha One. We are under fire. Alpha Two, mission critical craft. Shield down. Alpha Two, mission critical craft. Hull condition critical. Which one? What? What? Which, which craft? What's going on? The leopard? What the fuck? Well, hello, Mr. Fancy Pants. <laughs> Hey, thanks for the follow, one manco. The leopard. The leopard is being attacked by a bunch of guys. And the resupply is there. Okay. So we should clear the platform before disabling it. I think that's the problem here. Yeah, Alpha live and learn. Mission critical craft destroyed. Abort mission. Mission available. Abort. I'm gonna hear what he's saying. He's gonna tell me how to do it. Immediately target the platform and order your wingmen to attack it. With any luck, they will get a couple of rockets off while you quickly launch five of your own. Then engage the Z-95 headhunters yeah, that are trying to intercept you. Toggle to full laser and shield recharge. Concentrate on taking but out the starfighters. X-wings and T-wings will enter the battle next. Try to dogfight outside the range of the platform. There's gonna be Corvettes and shit. Okay, well, well, but but there's that guy that I did all that. No. <laughs> when the platform is disabled, a transport will try to make its yes. way to safety. Break off whatever you are doing and disable it. Yes, but doing that failed the mission, dude. So, just say. <laughs> Task is to disable the platform. <clears throat> Alpha Two, this is Flight Group Alpha using your target for attack. <coughs> Reinforcements acknowledged. Alpha Two, incoming missile. We need to capture the platform. Uh, these guys are really dangerous. Is there any other?
destroyed my tie. A, a guy in a tie defender got killed by a Z95. What the fuck? He deserved to die. I hope he's dead. It seems you never die in the tie fighter. And you always die in the next wing. What is this? Okay. 32%. Uh, let's go with two of those. Yeah, dual fire. We should do it. Let's attack it, dudes. They're all dead. Oops. I thought my shields were... Ooh, maybe I didn't have any more shields. <laughs> Look, I didn't die again. You never die. In X-Wing, you always die. I would have thought on the contrary, like, this is just a cockpit with little wings and that's it. Remember your primary task is to disable the platform. The TIE Defender is a little bigger, but the TIE... Uh, I, I'm killing this first. This is my first target. It's right there. Hello. Uh, platform, attack it. Shield. Dual fire. Four of those. Put more shields. And attack something else. Come on, guys, what the F is going on? Look! Look! Look, that's how you take it. I mean, it's almost impossible. Like, if you have three on you, but he's the last one. That's it. There's no others. There's no reason to. Uh, you suck. But I bet you I was in the next wing and I would be fighting those guys. They would kick my ass. Come on! There you go. Oh my god, okay, I, I didn't think they were that. But wow, that's powerful. Okay, I, I didn't think. Wow, what the fuck? I usually I can take it. Ah, we're gonna make it. This is this is totally normal if you haven't played these games. Yeah, this I should kill this right right there. It's already after. Uh, Target 
are you destroyed. Go. Request acknowledged, Alpha 2. Using your target for attack. Request reinforcements acknowledged. We need to capture the platform. Quickly disable it. Imperial transport here to reload you when ready, Alpha 1. Alpha 2, incoming missile. Can you attack that? Transmission received. Alpha 2, using your target for attack. Too close. Too close. Ah, oh, come on. Attack it, guys. Alpha two, using your target for attack. So the the worst run we did. Okay, let's attack something else. Oh, that's what I did last time. It's falling. Eighty-two percent. That's okay. Oh shit! Now I have no <laughs> no energy. Great. I'm too fast to for you, man. What's that? That's your new ship you were talking about, maybe? I have vague memories of this, but... If I don't remember them that much, that must be easy kill. T-Wings. Oh yes, T-Wings. Oh yeah, T-Wings. There's also E-Wings. I'm not kidding, E-Wings is a thing. Um, is there anything else? There might be another wing. Different than last time. Okay, I'm gonna disable the platform now. Oh, there's X wings? Yes, I need to disable the platform. Wish me luck. That's okay. <laughs> Good work in disabling the platform, Alpha One. Corvette's rampart to RS thirty two. We are here to help. Capturing the thing. Ah, oh, shit, shit. The, the blue guy. Hmm. Oh, he's there. Should I do it? 
Should I do it? Blue. Die? No, okay. Only go one. Eh? Okay. Supply, that's my guys, and then we have the enemy lines. Okay. So red three might be the there's the T wing gold four. Much going on. There's blue that's disabled. It's quite far, but whatever. Far from, I would have liked him to be like closer here, but I might have to destroy those uh, Corvettes. Eh! Oh no no, this is way too dangerous. I'm going not so fast. Do you stay there, Mr. Uh, T-Wing? You seem to park there. I'm gonna kill that A-Wing. No, no, I'm gonna go to the platform. Yeah, I think I need to uh, destroy that Corvette, or it will destroy... Alpha 2, incoming missile. Okay, I have to destroy the A-Wing first. Supply Alpha two boarding operation complete. Go Acknowledged Alpha two. Oh, oh. Reload operation. 
And part one is almost down. Yeah, attack it. Oh, I don't have any wingmans, it seems. Oh my god, it's down. We're in part two. What about the... Target destroyed. Reload. Operation complete. We're in part two. Alpha wow, two look at that. Capture. Operation. Look at that. Alpha two commence boarding. Operation. They're just destroying the guy. Woohoo! Alpha two capture operation. Good complete. shot. What about that thing? Oh Alpha yeah. Two. Secondary mission objectives completed. Target destroyed. Boarding operation. Whoa! We did mission all the things. Complete. Primary objectives completed. You have completed your mission. You may return to the cell tool. You have helped us capture a very important rebel structure. We are now in possession of Mag Pulse technology. Cell oh, that Murat almost died. Did it need to survive? No, not even. It was just there for backup. Hyperspace, cool. Two missions in a row. First, uh, first try. <laughs> That's uh, quite un unheard of. <laughs> uh. Okay. We didn't finish the we battle yet. We were successful yet. in our mission to capture several working copies of the Mag Pulse warhead. Unfortunately, while this operation was underway, the ZA-13 facility came under attack by more of Zarin's forces. Initial reports indicate that Zarin's forces were successful in destroying the plant, along with a Nebulon B frigate. Latest reports state that most of the other TIE advanced plants have also fallen. Zarin has been very thorough in ravaging Imperial factories. The Emperor is not pleased with the news of the loss of the Thai advanced plants. You helped us capture most of the top rebel staff trying to escape. We were also able to capture many important specialists who worked on developing and manufacturing the Magpulse weapon aboard the platform. Excellent work. Excellent. Zarin is trying to trap us. We cannot hyper to safety because of their interdictor cruiser. Not only will we lose the Magpulse technology, but more importantly our commander, Admiral Thrawn. Alpha Group must take out the interdictor before it is too late. Yes. TIE Advanced Group Beta will provide an escort. We have only two operational TIE Defenders and one TIE Advanced on board. We cannot count on our forces to arrive in time to save us. Our survival is now up to you. Great. This looks like the last mission of this uh, this battle. Oh, the Magpulse torpedo. Oh, it's not. No. Compared to what? It looks like crap. Oh, disables weapon systems. I guess. Okay, they give me that, so I will use it. I remember that. Disable weapon system. Do I have to target the weapon system? I'm gonna target the weapon system. So, Mr. Interdictor Grappler. Bridge, energy gen, laser gun, weapon. Wi no, wood. I know what that is. The platform is gone. We're next. Hurry, Alpha One. Bridge, Alpha One, a cruiser has entered the area and is heading for us. I guess I just have to shoot it. I, c I don't remember how it works. I can shoot it right now. Oh, that's it. Let's see how that works. <sighs> System at 25%. Holy shit. Okay, I need to reload. Alpha 1. Mission critical craft under attack. Can I reload? Order 
Acknowledged, sir. Using your target for attack. Request for reinforcements. Acknowledged. So there's no... Alpha 1. Incoming missile. There's no reload, it seems. Oops. Hm. I thought there would be. Okay. Reload. Excellent work, Alpha One. This is what I Targeting me. Alpha One, we have launched three TIE bombers to help. Good hunting. Okay. There's a reload. As long as there's somebody shooting at me, I can't do it. Because there's a button to target the nearest fighter attacking you, so as long as that button works, I can't reload. Well, I could, but I, I, I would certainly die. Well, not certainly, but it's, it's, not, it's not a good thing. You don't want to do that. Whoa! The game's attacking my frame rate. Oh, god damn it! I just want to reload anyways. Just take my chances. Target destroyed. Okay, we're so far. Good work. Hurry back. Uh, is the interdictor done? Maybe. What? Is it done? Done? Kidding me, the grappler is destroyed. Victory Star Destroyer Skeletor must have completed. Uh, Skeletor. He's hyperspacing. Okay. Nice! We're doing it! Wow, what the fuck was that? Eh, there's nobody else. These are mines. Wow, they're pretty beat up. Skeletor. Uh, a minute. Well. Oh. 
you've got company. little guy here. Oh my. Uh, Skeletor, Skeletor, where is it? I can't return to the Skeletor. I have to wait for space. It said return to the... Return to the Skeletor. By hyperspace. Another mission. Wow. What's going on? Oh. on our recent attacks. Admiral Zahn, we have destroyed all the Cedar fleet systems factories located in the Omar system. Excellent. The Empire has lost most of its capability to manufacture the Thai advanced starfighters. We will continue our destruction of the Emperor's military industrial centers. Soon he will have nothing but his pitiful force to rely on. Commander Ravine, order our forces to the Outer Rim. From there we will launch new attacks against the Emperor. Yes, sir, Admiral Zarin. Damn, do I love those little cutscenes. I guess they kind of look bad by today's standard, especially like that that thing blowing up with the with super stills and but I don't know. I loved them back in the day. But that guy talking and the the whole uniform colors thing, that was, that's an awesome little shot there. With the help of your heroic efforts, our forces made it out of there alive. The newly promoted Admiral Thrawn sends his personal congratulations and wishes that you join him in his efforts yes! to track Zarin yes! down. Yes! The Finally. Emperor has commanded Admiral Thrawn to destroy Zarin's forces and has made available to him the best resources in the Imperial Navy in order to accomplish this. I knew that you, you are one of these resources. Yes, thanks. I knew that one of that, that, that eventually you work for you worked for uh, for Mr. Thrawn. Battle nine. Wow. Tide defender technology. Secure tide defender technology. Zarin's forces are stripping the research facility where the TIE Defender was developed. They must be prevented from carrying out any sabotage or escaping with any critical technology. TIE Defender Group Delta will team with Assault Transport Group Omega to thwart Zarin's plans and regain Imperial control of the installation. TIE Defender Group Delta will initiate the operation by eliminating any Starfighter defenses. The platform can then be disabled, and Assault Transport Group Omega will debark a Stormtrooper <sighs> detachment to take control. That's Imperial Can't... Star Destroyer Adaga is being sent to defend the platform from any counterattacks. Would it be so hard to put them at Star another color? Stripping the research facility They're not the Imperials. Why are they red? 
Find another color. They must be prevented from carrying out any Green's for rebel. Uh, purple is for others, so put them purple. Find another color. Die defender group Delta will team with assault transport group Omega to thwart Zarin's plans. Tie defender group Delta will initiate the operation by eliminating any capture platform. Defenses. So do we have to disable it? As the platform can then be disabled, and assault transport group Omega will debark a stormtrooper detachment to take control. Am I the only one? Imperial here? star what? destroyer Adaga is being sent to defend the platform from any counterattacks. So they'll send that on top. Zarin's force. What? That seems crazy. You are to prevent Zarin's forces from stripping the research platform where he led development of the TIE Defender. Zarin is too smart not to have contingency plans for his failed coup attempt. His only hope may be in maintaining a slim technological advantage over loyal Imperial forces. If he can keep the Emperor from further development or deployment of the TIE Advanced or the TIE Defender, he will surely escape. With the Imperial Navy weakened in this way, the Rebels will be given a respite from our effort to wipe them out. If the Rebels are able to make a comeback, Zarin will take advantage of the situation. The TIE Defender R&D platform is to be captured, and any cargo craft entering the area are to be destroyed. Any opposition encountered at the station is to be swept aside. The Imperial Class Star Destroyer Adaga is en route and should arrive as the operation is concluded. Failure Con is not an option. Considering all the text that is read here, and here, and here, and a secondary mission, and the number of missions in this game, that's a lot of voices. Um. <laughs> uh, you will fly a TIE Defender Tractor designated beam. Delta-1. The platform is well defended by its own point defense systems, which include an advanced defensive missile system. Oh. Additionally, there should be at least one full squadron of TIE fighters or assault gunboats. You will be seriously I... outnumbered, but will have a tremendous edge in combat capability. Use it. I felt that the platform was using missile on me. It was. The Emperor wants Zarin and his pack of traitors destroyed. No one is to escape his wrath. To be sure that all of the traitors are caught, we will want to capture as many prisoners as possible. Any personnel shuttles or transport craft you encounter are to be disabled. The prisoners will be interrogated and all of their co-conspirators rooted out. Sorry, you didn't hear that, but it was loud. Okay. Advanced missiles. Advanced missiles. I don't want advanced missiles. Yeah, I want that. <laughs> if I have to disable that platform... Take out the TIE bombers as quickly as you can. Other TIE bombers? What? What's going on? Other TIE bombers? Why? Here, there's other bombers. Wow, they're really far. Like, that's how big the map is. Like, you see the edges there? <laughs> that's that's a big map. Because they are far. 15 is really far. Oh, I can go super fast with that. Uh... That ship now with the tractor beam, it's even crazy. Like we might be too late to stop one of those cargo ferries. I thought we were here to disable the platform. 
What's that? 70 percent, 75% of all cargo ferries must be destroyed. 50, uh, bomber must be destroyed. Platform must be captured. Shuttle must be captured. Escort carrier JIT must be destroyed. Uh, okay. Okay, second two. Don't let it get away. Um, yeah, just a second. Cargo ferry Zakin. No. Uh, keep an eye on cargo second two. Don't let it get away. Second two. Second two. Oh, it's pretty far. It's it's gone, dude. There's, it's kind of no way. Of, in what direction is it going? There? If it's going there, what? Do I need to barter? Zaykin. It's doesn't say anything about that. That's a cargo ferry, that's one of the cargo ferry, I guess. Whoops. It needs to be destroyed. Yeah, I could use missiles, well, my big rockets on them. But these guys are pretty big. Radio message received, Delta One, using your target for attack. down really fast. <clears throat> it's going away! It's not doing anything. I don't know why they said that. Anyway, anyway it's dead now. Now it looks like it's going somewhere. Maybe. Cilion. Shuttle must be captured. Fifty percent of shuttles. Epsilion. Epsilion. One wing man down, Delta One. Be careful. He sucks. You just lost your other wingman, Delta One. You're on your own. They suck. Against what? That cargo ferry? It's a cargo ferry. Delta one, incoming missile. <laughs> that was awesome. Okay, I'll take a little break here. I'll be back.
Okay. <clears throat> what do you say? Order your wingmen to attack the nearest enemy that is attacking you. Hit key E and then shift A. As soon as you're able, target the platform's warhead launcher and take it out with three missiles. Oh. Remember, you can engage from as far as six kilometers away. Then clear the remaining TIE bombers. If you have missiles left, Take out some of the platform's laser guns and turrets. The guns require a single missile, the turrets two or three. Remember to remain outside the platform's turbo laser range of 1.5 kilometers. Turbo laser, ah, oh, that's what killed me. They're really dangerous. Watch for the event messages regarding transports and shuttles. Be prepared to take out their shields quickly with a single missile then switch to ion cannons. When attacking escort carrier Jitta, try to take out the gun turrets first. Your firing run should be along a path that has you grazing the carrier's hull and presenting the turret in profile. Skillful wow. evasive maneuvers will allow you to remain close enough to the carrier to draw its fire, but avoid damage. This will help Assault Transport Omega tremendously, since it will allow them to keep a steady course while making rocket attack runs. Okay, so the transport Omega is doing the rockets. I was just thinking, uh, going, <laughs> going in and just do it myself. Just pour it with rockets. It will go down. No? No, I want to do the mission again. Let's try rockets again. Just I wanna it's, it's kind of a test. That's yeah, I can do all that, destroy the But it's a lot of missiles and a lot of time to do all that. Take out the tie bombers as quickly as you can. Oh, cause the tie bomber is gonna kill my guy. But he's not gonna disable the thing. Missile, it kind of fucks them up and they can't hit you. But that didn't work. That didn't work. So, um, my missile did oh, 66%. Yeah, I guess that's not super great. Okay, I'm gonna try it their way <clears throat> uh, with the missiles. It's cool that they lit. They let it at what you uh, what you put it. So if I want to go on with uh, heavy rockets, then you go on with heavy rockets. So attacking me? That's not attacking me. That's attacking me. Transmission received. Delta one using your 
target for attack. Uh, the platform. Looks like we might be too late to stop one of those cargo ferries. There's your guns. Cargo. Keep an eye on cargo ferry sinking yeah. too. Don't let it get away. There's your turrets. Landing platform. I'm just gonna go with laser turrets, I guess. Are they under? If they're under, I'm in the right. Uh, the wrong. <sighs> Got that. I'm gonna restart that. I'm gonna go under it, I think. I'm not sure. Can you zoom on a thing? Well, once it's. Take out the tie bombers as quickly as you can. Radio message received using your target for attack. Like it's under, but can I see it takes like a couple of missiles? It said two or three missiles from under. Does it work? Yes, it worked. Oh my god, just one missile did it. That other turret, that other turret. Oh, I'm way too close. Delta one, incoming missile. Yeah, those missiles are dangerous. I know what they are, but they're dangerous. My transport's still Keep okay. An eye on it don't let it Delta one, incoming missile. Ah, I'm too close. Now no more missiles. <laughs> I hit the missile Delta with my missile. missile. Yeah, yeah, I guess. I don't know how to destroy the missile platform. It's like laser turret, landing platform, hull, landing platform, laser gun. I don't know what it is in there. Delta one. Incoming missile. Weed, weed, lin. Weapon. No, it's. I don't know what that is. Okay, laser turrets. Delta one, incoming missile. I can't. I, I just can't destroy it with my. Uh... Ah, this is bad. I don't know how to do this mission. 
I just don't know what to target on the platform. We should send missile thing and we target the missiles. Take out the tie bombs. Clearly they're on the top. Yeah, fuck the tie bombers. Transmission received. Delta one using your target for attack. Request reinforcements acknowledged. I have a feeling that's one. Just one missile. Delta one, incoming missile. Oh, that didn't work. The beam. I forgot about the beam. Another cargo ferry. Keep an eye on it and don't let it escape. Delta one, incoming missile. Yes. Still missiles. I don't know if it's, it's it might be the bombers. Oh, I'm just stupid now. Delta one incoming missile target disabled. What's disabled? That's weird. That one's under, that's why I can't hit it. Delta one, incoming missile. Okay. Or oh, down the side. No, I'm not on the right side. So I'm gonna destroy the turrets, since I think that's the worse. Then I'm gonna concentrate on the bombers. Or maybe I should destroy the bombers first. <clears throat> yeah, let's do that. Take 
out the tie bombers as quickly as you can. I can definitely do that. Delta Force incoming missile. That's an enemy. Okay. <clears throat> the second two was Delta One, incoming missile. This missile destroyed it destroyed in my face, you mean? What was that? Was that one of my guys? on the other side. Fuck it. Bombers are maybe all down. Shuttles are must be captured soon. The platform is captured and the cargo ferry must be destroyed. Okay, I'll, I'll deal with the turrets of the of this. Yeah, let's go up. Gun, gun. Cargo, 
come on. Is it? No, not these ones. These ones, yeah. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Okay. So a cargo ferry escaped. Can I reload? there wow take out the tie bombers as quickly as you can I shouldn't even care about the shuttles. Okay, next up is Mr. Saiken. Second one, I guess. Oh, he's gone. So, second one is pretty much unsalvageable. Radio message received, Delta One. Using your target for attack. Yeah, let's go around. Does this needs to... That's just a container. Care about a container. I'm not even going at full speed. Yeah, I should go away. And then go in. Away and in. No 
following my lasers. There you go. Almost done, guys. Second four. Here's another cargo ferry. Don't rely on those assault. Transport pilots to get it. Acknowledge Delta One. Using your target for attack. That could have killed me. I'm going away. It's tie bombers, perfect. That I can do. They won't hyperspace out these guys. I want you. My shields were down behind me. Wow, that was going great. Oh my god. If I could reload in the mission I would use my missiles. But I'm not sure I can and I want to be able to use a missile to destroy the turrets. Take out the tie bombers as quickly as you can. <sighs> Looks like we might be too late to stop one of those cargo ferries. Well, anyways. Yeah, that 
that's okay. Usually when I, I'm lucky enough to be able to... Because... To put your shield equal, you have to... There's no... There should be a button equal shields. But you have to do like front, rear, equal. If you want to equalize your shields. But while you're doing front, rear, equal, you might do front and then you're being backstabbed. Okay, I'm gonna Take out the tie call for reinforcements. Request for reinforcements acknowledged. Do this. Okay. care about the shuttles now. I only care about this one because the first one Ordering was hyperspace space out. Your target for attack. I'm gonna go around. It's done. Excellent hunting target destroyed. Target disabled. Are they disabling the shuttle? Yeah. Good hunting, 
on that one. attack run. You see all those lasers? Oh, 40. It's, yeah, it's almost dead. Okay, this is going good. Please, please don't die. Good tie bombers, pilots. because I'm in a really good situation here. something about these guys. Okay. What about the goals? Seems not so bad. But they want me to destroy the escort carrier, which will be difficult. That's a resilient Delta fucking... Incoming. Wow!
Brazilian TIE Fighter. That's all. That's whole damage. Do they have shields? They have shields! Modified TIE Fighters. Holy shit. That's much better. That's almost an A-Wing now. Maybe even better. I think it's better than an A-Wing now. <laughs> That's quite an upgrade. And they have missiles also. I don't think it really works like plot-wise or logically, but it's Star Wars. Because I, I thought the whole point of the TIE Fighter is a little nimble, really small, because there's nothing in it. If you put more thing in it, it becomes bigger. Thus, the TIE advance. <laughs> so whatever. It is a game. They want to do it. They want to do it. They do it. Uh, it just doesn't want to die. Wow. Um, I don't need to die to kill these guys. Oh my god. Did you see how many guys there is? Omega. What is Omega? Oh, Omega might be for the platform. Okay. Jit. The guy that I need to destroy. And then there's a bunch of uh, lambdas and epsilons, which I think are my guys. So this might be doing well. Platform. It's a little less dangerous now, I think. Yeah, it looks less dangerous, but that tug is really like on the platform, so I have to target Delta something one. else. Incoming missile. Oh, the tug's dead. to be captured. Oh my. The platform still has missiles. Oh well. So what's going on if I check the map? Oh my god, over there. It seems all scrambled. And there's all this here. Oh, that's bad. That's another transport down. Might be the first, I don't know.
Ah. Obsidian and that though. We got five, six, three. Ah, uh, there's almost no tile left. Oh my god! Okay, Omega is doing something. Uh. I know what's going on. <laughs> I don't know what they are doing, the Omegas. Target destroyed. What about the platform? Eighty-six <laughs> percent. Omega 5 is... 6 is okay... Um, that big thing, where is it? Oh, is it destroyed? What, are you kidding me? It is destroyed! Oh, we should capture the shuttles and maybe... Oh, let's capture some shuttles. Uh, this one. Oh, this one might be captured... Rebel, this one also. Wow, they did that all by themselves. The Tau, the these guys, row and. Okay, I still have two missiles. So let's go on the R and D lab. I think we're doing it.
I'm gonna go on there and try to destroy all one of these basic turrets here. Ten shields. It's done. Yeah, you can see them. Target disabled. There you go. Uh, it's not captured. Platform shields have dropped. Switch to iron cannons now. <laughs> uh, it's done. Cool. Time is four. So we might be attacked here. Delta one, begin capture operation. Uh, X-wing would have a tendency at the the end of the campaigns, like at the end of the game, uh, the expansion all mission would have like multiple phases. But I think that's it. This has been going for twenty minutes now. There you go. Excellent. The research station has been secured. Great work against those traitors, Delta One. Imperial class star destroyer Hadaga has entered the battle. Ah, shuttles are not captured yet. Delta One, intercept that A wing before it gets away. Eh. Okay, I can do that. Let's do that. <laughs> the mission's over, but there's still stuff going on. It's awesome. That's what's awesome about this game. Yeah, that's... I mean, I've never seen any game do that. As much. Sometimes, but... He was about to destroy the shuttles, I think. So, yeah, Pacho is... Uh, waypoint 1. Hmm. Waiting boarding. Omicron one, waypoint one. Oh. Ah, should we just finish this? We have A wings now for the bonus goals. Man, if I die here well if I die here we will still succeed in the mission. I have a feeling that there is not much going on. Start position. That nobody's boarding. Well, I thought these two patros would do it. But I'm gonna kill the A wings and then fly home, I guess. Come on. Okay, we're there. Be careful, they're gonna use missiles. Delta one, incoming missile.
Now we have Y wings or X wings. Then we have a bunch of T wings. Oh man, I'm, I'm getting the hell out of here. So, good mission, all in all. Quite a complicated mission if you want to be efficient about it. And I wasn't able to... Uh... So there was a couple of... The, the transport that was supposed to uh, capture the shuttles got destroyed. But yeah, wow. We thwarted Zarin's attempt to escape with the TIE Defender technology, and we have established loyalist control over the facility. We must now protect it from any further attacks or sabotage. Okay, so we just captured it, now we have to protect it. Watch for the event yeah. messages regarding transports and shuttles. Yeah, I know. So I think this will be all for today. The research Mission facility two. where the Tide Defender was developed. So there's 13 battle. We're at battle nine. Yeah. So battle nine. Mission two. There's still a bunch of missions left. There's about like s four to s six, maybe even eight, for the top ones. Six. Four to eight, but usually like six missions per battle. So that's it, and uh, unfortunately, but it's not the end of the world, I would not be continuing like TIE Fighters uh, Sunday or Monday or something like that. Um, I will be using TIE Fighter as a game that will fill holes. Um, if, I, if I finish a game too soon in a stream, I might do a couple of missions before ending the stream. Um, yeah, that's it. So tomorrow I'll be playing some Might and Magic. Uh, Saturday no stream. And Sunday I should be starting Faxanadu. The remastered version. Oh yes. So I'm excited about that. That should take about the week. Like Sunday, Tuesday and Thursday. Faxanadu. And in between that, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, we continue Might and Magic. No problem. Good night, Senator. Thanks everyone for watching. Um, remember that every stream is at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. All every day, except Saturdays. Let's raid someone. Mr. Busy Plasma, who's playing some silly FPS's on the PC, looks like... Looks weird. <laughs> Thanks again for watching, remember to have fun, peace.